Hey boys! Well, what? thanks for inviting me to play one of your games today. Uh, what is this? Well, it is a game I found from... I was watching YouTube and I found these old videos about this game and I was like, that looks pretty fun. So I got it. And it is pretty fun. It looks uh, this looks like Adventure Time. Is this an Adventure Time game? It's not really Adventure Time. It's the Adventure Pals. It's not time. Okay, the Adventure Pals. I don't know anything about this game, Connor. This is, uh, you surprised me with this one. What kind of game is this? This looks like a role-play game. Well, is it's an, like like Zelda? an action platformer puzzle game. Okay, well, I think I understand why I've never heard of this game before. That is not my most favorite genre but it looks action. cool um platforming games in general like if it's not a mario game i kind of don't like them um well but you know it looks pretty cool i, I kind of dig this overworld i'm kind of doing a quest right now for the guy on chicken who will not stick in my party at all but the three people so far that will be sticking in my party are the giraffe which is called sparkles and mr rock but I have a skin for him that makes him look like a battery. Okay, so that thing following you is a rock with the battery skin on it. Yep. And the other guy following you has it's, a chicken? Yeah, it's just a co side quest that I have to do. Well, it's it, not a side quest. Is the quest. chicken sick? No. Is he trying to save the chicken? No, he's trying. Is he crying for some reason? It looks he's like he's got tears. He's trying to find his wife, which is actually pretty funny. Has his wife turned into the chicken? No. Okay. The chicken right. is literally just how he gets around. Connor. Oh, he's riding the chicken. Yes. Okay, the, that's better. Okay, so. Is this an M-rated game? No, it is not. It's, okay. It's E10. All right, I'm just not sure what he's doing with that chicken. Now, these are adorable little animals in the overworld. Get back here. Well, you can kill them. Hey, this is like a... Uh, is this a survival game? No, it is not a survival oh, game. We this, can get into the levels and tell them This is giving me some vibes of, uh... Don't starve. Why don't we just hop into the first level? The first level? I thought you already beat the first level. Oh, okay. If you want to see the second level already... Well, we don't well, have to see before the Before I get into the tutorial levels, level I stuff. I should tell you the plot and things. Okay. So. This should be good. It started off as my birthday, and I got the giraffe for my birthday. Sparkles. Uh huh. Right. I also got this magical sticker book, which I didn't find out until later in the game, but I'll get to that later. And there's this guy called Mr. B, which is B. Oh, literally I... just a letter B. And he is turning all the old people into hot dogs. Is that that guy up there? It looks like a bee? No. Oh, that's not Mr. That's B? That's Apu. He's the short store guy. So Mr. B is not a bee, but He's Apu a human, is a bee. But he has he rides a giant robot bee. Okay. Connor. And he's trying to turn all the old people into hot dogs. And you gotta go through all the levels doing silly side quests to get rubies to kind of bribe him to stop turning to not turn his dad into a hot dog. Yeah, so I hope you aren't eating any hot dogs for power-ups. Nope. Okay. There isn't really any power-ups. So, well, I'll just hop into the level now, and you can see what I'm talking about. Fort Con Venison, all right. This is the second level. All right, Elias, what do you want, bud? So, Connor, I, I, I think I know why it's called Adventure Pals. Because the draft is the guy's pal. Yes, they called them pals, the little allies. Now, B button jumps, Y button swings their little sword. Okay. A button, dang it, I did not mean to throw that button. A button uses whatever item you have equipped. And I have some different items in my bag I can use. Some bombs and some potions. Health potions. Okay. Yeah. Can I'll you have more than bombs. two? What do you think? Yeah, you can. I just threw a light bomb, which is really expensive. I bought it. Uh -oh. But I accidentally threw it. And. Well, how does this game save? Like, oh. can you not save it and then play again later and keep that bomb? Well... Or is it automatically saved? I did save it earlier, so I could restart my save. Yeah, I just wonder if you'll get well, somewhere and then not be able to save it. You but. see, save and quit too many. Yeah, so don't do that no. if you... You just no, saved I and quit. Oh, little Connor. You gotta pay Starting. attention. 
maybe there should be a game that challenges you to pay attention to what it says and like almost like Simon Says. I bet you're not very good at Simon Says. Have you played Simon Says? No. <laughs> I have. Well, I have. Well, but... Okay. Hey, look at this giraffe. Ooh, that's cool. Is that his tongue? Yeah. See. Nice. With the normal jump, you can use your giraffe as a little helicopter buddy. Mr. Rock is a throwable object, and he is... Oh, wait, he's talking. Farmer Joe is his name. You know, I'm not so sure about this. We could get hurt. Don't worry. You just stay back and let me handle any danger. Yeah, not yet, though. I found something. Now, you know how I told you about the sticker book? Uh-huh. There's a sticker pack right up there. Whoa, you're like wall jumping. Yeah, you can do that. That's pretty cool. There's a sticker pack. Let's see what the sticker I've got. I've already got a sticker. Ooh, collectibles. Random collectibles. There's also other collectibles you can get. You got two out of 44. You see those cupcakes up there as well? Yep. I can also collect those, and they can be given to this one guy in the shop who can give me skins. That's how I got Mr. Rock's skin. Okay. You mean Mr. Batters? Mr. Rock. Mr. Rock the King Use as a projectile. Oh no. Goodbye. All right. Yeah, you kind of hit enemies when they go flying, which is really useful. Oh no, some cow bandits. Yes, these are bandits. Bam. He's not dead. Bam. You know, Gas tank. Whoa, careful! That took. That hurt. It looks like. Is that blue bar your health, or what is that blue bar under you? Um, XP points. Oh, okay. Look, For the next level, are you level one? Yes. I see on the you upper see left. Level zero. Okay. Oh, you found a cupcake. Cool. Hey, you know this does look pretty cool. This reminds me of some roguelikes I've been playing lately. Although I know this isn't a roguelike game. Uh, it looks like it plays kind of like. One. My draft has many uses. One of them being a wrench. Oh, a little bit of uh, a kind of class. Ooh. Remember that one? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's telling me I can directionally dodge using the arrow button. Uh, isn't that just called moving away from the punch? No, it's a dodge move I can use with these buttons. Oh, okay. This is different than just walking. Now, this looks like it's oh, controlling pretty well. Oh, look at this bomb well. slide. <laughs> That's cool. It's a pretty cool combo. That hey, Connor, I saw, like, a ruby test. Down. I know. That ruby chest will get me some battle upgrades and things. Oh, I can spend 50 coins on that chest, which I won't do. Because it's obviously just going to give me more items I don't need. I will take this critical hit damage upgrade. Wow. This is like a... This is definitely... I'm getting a lot of dead cells. I know you don't play dead cells, because I think that's a... Wait, did we do? We did it. We did a quick. We did a look on that, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. So, no, it's not Emery. It's Tina. Oh, I thought it was Emery. No, it's Wait, just Is there Tina. anything down here? It's a death. It's death. Get wall jump back up. Wall jump back up. You can do it. You can do it. Yeah, I just gotta keep wall jumping and using my dress a little. Just luck. Hey, you know what? I wouldn't be surprised if you go a little bit further down. There might actually be something. There. I already checked before. Okay. I got like halfway into this level before, and that is death. Okay. Hey, look, the end of the level. Oh, yeah, I mean, I see some of the same kinds of gameplay as Dead Cells, but in a more kid friendly way. And, and it's not a roguelike. Right, it's, it's not a roguelike. Reason. Which is fine. That's just another now, way to. You can see, I am not going to throw up level at some parts, and like I told you, we're getting rubies to bribe off Mr. B. Stop. That is a hot dog. Uh oh. Thing. Well, you Fix can't fall here. down those, though. Boink. But good enough. I thought you could drop on enemies. Oh. You're thinking of Mario. No, I swear you could drop Maybe on you can get that ability, though. Right? Yeah. Seems like, whoa, what was that? Did you just throw Mr. Rock? Yeah, you can do that as, like, a projectile. You did it so fast. Dang it, I should heal. Hey, I have my light bomb back. Oh, maybe get one for level. No, -uh, I bought that. Bro, I think I should hurt. These uh, things are idiotic. 
The first time I came down here, this thing surprised me so bad. Did they hurt? Are they bad guys? Yes, those are bad guys. So, they kind of look like uh, Higgledies from are... Nino Kuni. <laughs> I was so close to dying. If you die, you just lose some of your gold. Gold is how you buy things in the shop, though, so you don't really lose that. Also, you can buy stickers in the shop. And what do the stickers do again? They're just little collectible items. Okay. You got, oh, by the way, if you didn't hear me in the beginning, I said that the sticker book was a present you got for your birthday as well as sparkles. And Mr. Rock was just one of your friends. Stu, it's farting blue thing. They fart? Yeah. Well, plug your nose. Oh, there was a hot dog. Oh, you gotta rescue the hot dog? By defeating the hot dog, I gained... Yeah. Oh yeah, I still have my critical hit damage. You gotta damage. beat up the hot dog with an old person, right? No, by beating up the hot dog, you free the old person who somehow has Superman powers. Or did you just kill him and he was like, hey. No. And he just floated you away. You free the old person. I don't know if freeing is the correct word there. But... It is freeing, okay? It says in the trailer. <laughs> Free the old people, you need a heal. Uh, oh, I do need a heal. I might even need to open one of those money cost chests. What? What's in those? Oh, they give you items instead of having to buy them from the shop. You can find item mine things mid level. And oh out. my, <laughs> that that seemed like a bad thing to do. You have no, oh, you did. No, I need to get XP. That's okay, why. Okay, no, you're that. fine. I thought you didn't. Also, free the old person. Yay! Yeah, okay. I don't know if that's... It looked a little translucent. Like a ghost. I'm just saying. I know. Hey look, I'm almost level up. Just some more fighting and... Those things are evil. I'm serious. What? Spikes? You mean oh, you can't yeah. land on okay, those? This is the... No, they'll hit... Dad. I I've never seen... Okay, this is the funniest <laughs> part in the entire game so far. You I have seen. to kill the piggy. No, I don't. It's funny. Okay. My beautiful bride. Yeah, apparently his wife was the pig all the long. Okay. Boink. Is it like Yo, the hot dog? That's a pig. You have to defeat the pig to unleash? Nuh-uh. Oh, come the piggy. He's just, you know, stuff. Boink. Yeah. He just, dude, the reason I unlocked this level is because I had to do the quest for him. To unlock the level. Okay, so is that the level? Nope. I what? still got three more sections to do. To okay. get the ruby. So what's the point of the level? To get the ruby? To get the ruby at the end of the level. Every yeah. level has a ruby. Yes. Every level has a ruby. Whoa! Here we go. And I've got a little card. Now, normally you'd Ooh, get I a like choice. card deck building games. No, they you get are to just build a deck? upgrades for your guy. You don't get Oh, you don't get to play him but against anybody? Normally, you'd get three choices for a card, but because I've already done those three choices, they gave me one choice. It's called Rock Rescue. As long as you have health left, Mr. Rock will rescue you from spikes and fall. Thank you, Mr. Rock. So maybe next time you're going to get three cards to choose again? Mm -hmm, maybe. I mean, because you're out of cards. Here, you can see a few abilities. I have the XP magnet, Ooh, which makes the XP orbs come to me, and I've got that Mr. Rock upgrade. Okay. I don't want to allow you to use Mr. Rock upgrade. Like, can you like, wait? Can you do that again? Nope. Uh, so that's a one-time use. Okay. So it's not like you have to turn it one way to unlock something. No. Turn it another way. Again. Also, this Hunter, is a secret area. Connor, I saw another um, feature. The cupcakes are optional? Yes, but I like unlocking. You can unlock like different hats and skins for Mr. Rock and things. So I like doing it just so I can give my character a little variety. Okay, sounds good. Not going. Oh, wait, I have to go that way. Trying to do my rock glide thing. Ooh, nice. Critical! I love that critical hit after it. You're almost out of it. I know, it's almost, it's a time thing, I think. Oh yeah, there's still little dots left. 
No, Burning every, jellies. Kind of every time you use them. Every time I get a critical? Yeah, if you use a critical. Why I can't out? use Yeah, the you don't use a critical, but you yeah. might get a bonus once. Yeah, yeah this you is one don't. of my favorite. You use the run, the thing, you get to other things, just to continue. That is one of the most simple but genius puzzle designs ever. I don't know if that's fine. technically a puzzle. No. I mean, you have to do it. It's not like you're solving it. It's kind it. of a puzzle. Yeah, kind of. I don't know what they call it. But Thank you for filling that guy bomb. Fine. So the well is your exit to the yeah. section? Yeah. There was this one game named Clux in town. He built these wells and he just yell, use them to teleport from place to place. Uh, do you know if this is a cartoon? Like, is this some cartoon on some, um, network? Uh, no, it is not a cartoon. I do not think you they don't might think it's a cartoon? Been. I don't know. It's just, it has such a wacky story, and, uh, it's hard for me uh, to believe that they just, that there isn't a cartoon like this somewhere, you know what no. I mean? It just seems like it has lore that existed before but it's it's very strange the reason this wanted poster of us is here is because we're exploring bandit camps oh. collecting their rubies to try to bribe so you're stealing no they stole the rubies we're kind of retrieving them is that what they told you no i just made that up <laughs> but i think that's what it these are bandit camps and I mean, nothing. you're you're not on an alien planet or anything, are you? Nope. This is supposed to be normal. Or... Okay. You gonna call? No, it it's actually not normal it's because someone mentioned dinosaurs in the Westlands, but it's sort of supposed to be like it. Oh. This is one of my least favorite parts of the game. All the enemies are at you at once, and it's like so infuriating because throw some rocks. Mr. Rock can only be used to throw at certain things. You can't throw Mr. Rock at everything. Oh, he's not a weapon? No. He's a puzzle solver in the can. Yes. Oh, okay. I want to you that, but my sword is a weapon. weapon. Yeah, do you see the old person? Yeah, um, there was a hot dog in the match. I know, we saw the hot dog, but we didn't see the person go away. Oh, there was a person. I saw the person. All hot dogs are pretty cool. Oh, you missed it. Now what are you going to do? You can't get over there. I can use my giraffe hover ability. And you can make it all the way to the second one? Well, I could hit him by hitting them. You seem to get a little boost of it. I know, that's what I mean, but you lost the first one. See? Oh, man, that's... There's some spikes up Maybe that resets it. I would hope so, because you're kind of in trouble right now. Unless you can go higher. No, I saw way. You see that wrench right there? Oh, that might be Use the it. wrench that Oh, that could be the reset one, huh? See, I told you. Yeah, good job, man. No, it, someone's popped me. Uh, oh! Hey, I like I Connor's like... first way better, though. <laughs> Would've been... Dang it, stupid mushroom thing. Did they hurt you? Yes, they did. But I didn't see. You get the rabbit. No, don't want to kill... Die? You don't want to kill the rabbit. They don't give you anything. Hmm. This is my nightmare. Spikes. Mr. Rock will save you. Hey, look. Okay, behind the level. There you go. Oop. So is there one cupcake per section? Yes. And there's one sticker pack per level. Ah, so that's so far always been the same. Yes. Nice. what do you think about this one? Awesome. You like this? I like the draft. Are you going to try this one? Yeah. You like this type of game? Yeah. This jumping and attacking yeah. and puzzle well, We haven't stuff. even gotten into the town or store yet. Okay, well maybe you have to, this is your last uh, section, right? Mm, yes. You're doing good. You're dodging Stupid well. bow guy. Uh, uh, uh oh, that was a little bit. I hate You got these. any, uh, you need to find a bow weapon. Range attack. They can roll apparently. There you go, good job. This is one of the points I died the most. Just that he keeps jumping and splashing. 
Oh yeah, this is like the first level with an actual Conical puzzle cake. section right here. Conical cake. I can't get that into later. So, no, not that place. You gotta go over here. Turn this wrench. Go over here. Mr. Rock to destroy that. Go over here. Do this wrench. Wow, now that's more here. puzzly for sure. The throne is stuck at this thing. And this is one of the only I will be accepting to take. Dang it, it did not have a health potion in it. So you got some bombs that you already had? Yes, and you so can't carry worthless. more than three items so far at least. It doesn't, it seems like you won't run out of money very though. Really. Not really. So oh one, yeah, this one of these, okay, there's a red one. That means you haven't done it yet. Yeah. That's how I get it. That's a great. Cupcake will be over Combo. there. Which is easy. Watch. Ooh, man, them spikes got him. That was... You gotta be careful with spikes too. Yep. Mr. Cupcake. Oh man, this going to make me hungry. I should make some cupcakes. Yeah. Hot dogs and cupcakes for lunch. That explains why there's some bombs. I already had one. Before I get into that fight, I must be as greedy as possible. Hey, that, that, that wrench thing is red. Ooh, double hot dogs. I gotta free two old people then. There's one, there's the other. And I somehow knock an old uh, hot dog dead body into another. There we go, and this is level. That's the end of the level? The boss? No. Right, wait, why do you have two out of three? Oh, I beat the first level in that game. Well, what happens when you get three? Game over? Short game? No! Then there's Obviously, the boss there's. Fight. No, yeah, maybe. Obviously, there's gonna be some sort of plot twist. It said 25 levels. 25 Not levels? Three. I think it did at least somewhere around that uh, well it does look like a big overworld so okay. like i see that thing up there that's locked what does that mean you can't go there obviously that's, a level so that's I another level do, I think. hey you got a plus on that level good job bud yay i think that's because they didn't die i didn't take that much damage yeah that was good impressive and i think i got a lot of comments now this is the shop the b shop so, uh -huh. This is a food shop owner, and you can buy sticker packs for a lot, shine bomb, sunshine bombs, bombs, and small HP potions, which we're going to take two of them because I'm almost out. Hey, what's that fat cat there with the cupcake? Oh, this is the cupcake king. You oh give my. him your cupcakes, he turns them into accessories. Accessories? Yeah, like this. He Another just... costume from Mr. Rock. Uh, but you have to have at least five cupcakes. It is random. Five cupcakes for one thing? Yes. And you have that many things to get? You're right, there's probably definitely 25 levels. Annoying Dexter. And what's the sticker pack again? A costume? Sticker pack? Yeah, you can buy a sticker pack. Yeah. yeah. It'll just give me a new sticker for my collection. Mm. Gotta do the draft. Yay! I <laughs> have the draft costume from Mr. Rock. Now let's go back to town. It's just the next one. Well, first I go back to town. I should go back to the lighthouse, which isn't really that important. But I should tell you anyways. Alright, is this the town? What are you talking about? No. This I'm is going the to overworld? Lighthouse. Yes. Lighthouse. It's your main town? Well, that's the main, that's some of the Ofa world at least. This isn't the main town, this is my mom's lighthouse. These fox guys are the guys who rescued me, they don't want to leave. And I can't really interact with her yet. Well, that's good. Can you go in the house? Well, I've talked to her before, and she told me how I needed to get the rubies for Mr. B. To prevent your dad from being turned into a hot dog. Yes. Well, who cares? If he turns into a hot dog, just beat him up and free him. 
This seems easy. No, this seems a lot easier. Oh my gosh, I did not realize the radioactive island has a living piece of toast on it. Of I course it does. I saw the radioactive island before. Who doesn't like a piece of radioactive toast? I know. I saw the radioactive island before and I was like, that can't mean that much. I never saw the piece of toast. I just thought it was... Hey, there's a graveyard. What's in there? Oh, that's one of the, that's the, one of the next levels. I think. It's all the old people you beat out of the hot dogs. <laughs> yeah, they went up to heaven. So this is one of the first town. Green Acre. Oh, do they give you uh, missions there? Well, let's talk to everyone. Oh, he's all happy. Yeah, now. So the guy's just happy. Pinky says grunk. When did Pink say grunk? Alright, come back later for some free bacon. Uh, okay. Free bacon. Oh yeah, that's my jam. Maybe Dad should get Dad now tomorrow often. <laughs> no, that is a bad thing. Okay, male guy who seems to eat letters. Don't tell anyone, but if someone says a letter to the Wastelands or Pirate Cove, I just eat the mail and tell them I delivered it. Like I'd go, like I'd go all the way there. Oh my. And then this is the Clux guy. That bad boy bandits are dangerous. Cluck, cluck. I'm surprised you made it back in one piece. I've seen bandits and creatures beyond this land. I've even been told there are dinosaurs in the white waste lands. Shudder. <coughs> Best from back home, kiddo. Yeah, this is how I all feel so can see my stickers. Now this girl's new. I couldn't talk to her before. Hey there, short, pale, and adorable. Don't look so upset. I can help you with your dad. If you need rubies, I saw Captain Bones King near Shady Willows. You know, the terrifying demon who feeds on children in the night. Oh my. But I'm a children. I have to run to my bed after I turn off the light at night. I guess it doesn't matter. Nobody else can do it. Captain Bones, let's throw down. He might be the first boss. Yeah, sounds like it. Defeat him. So then, did that just open up the third level? Yep. So, so there's map. a decent story. You have to talk to people to unlock the next level. This is only the first too. town. And the trailer showed two other towns. Alright, well, is there anything else to this game? Or is that pretty much it? It sounds level like up. some story, level after level, some pretty good looking platform adventure gameplay. You can find cupcakes on the map. I've just collected all of them that I've found already. Okay, so there's some overworld map secrets or things to do. Yeah. There's what are those cupcakes little here. birds you keep getting? Normal enemies like everything else, mm. but they're just super hard to kill. Oh yeah, but for killing these enemies you get coins. Okay. And then maybe you'll get a boat someday it looks like, or some way to travel to new lands, right? Yeah, look, there's Airship. the pirates area over there yep. called the... Porto is there any more map to this like an over uh, another map screen with the bigger picture of the land or is this it? What are those other buttons up there other buttons or not buttons, but can you tab over to something else? No, okay it like it. All right Connor. Well, I'll tell you what bud this game does look pretty interesting. Um, I had not heard of it It's a little strange, but I like strange so that's cool um, it looks like the gameplay is pretty fun. It has lots of different variations to moving around and solving those puzzles. And I, it, I'm guessing you'll get more as you go, right? Yep. Uh, did you have the wrench and all the and the giraffe tongue slow down yes. fall? Is it all that start from the beginning? You had giraffe at the beginning. You didn't get Mr. Rock until beating level one. Okay, so you had the giraffe and the sword at the beginning. As long as they keep adding some new interesting elements to the gameplay as the game goes on, I think this looks like a really fun game. Are you gonna play it, Lias? Yeah. You like how it looks? Yeah. Okay. I like how it attracts mysterious and. Do you think it's weird and funny? Yeah. Yeah, you like that? I like where, like, the giraffe's supposed to always turn and use it as a helicopter. Yeah, that is pretty cool. All right, well, there you have it, guys. That is uh, Connor's presentation of The Adventure Pals. Uh, we're playing it on the Switch. 
I have no idea if it's on anything else. Is it on Xbox? I swear it's on Xbox and maybe on computer. Maybe Yeah, Steam. I would guess it's probably on Steam. Um, I'm not sure if it's on PS4 or Xbox. It wouldn't surprise me if it was. But, uh, yeah, let us know if you guys played this game. Is this a new game for you? Did, did I just miss this game totally? Uh, Connor seems to like it a lot. Uh, let us know what you think about the Adventure Pals, whether you would want to buy it based on what you've seen here, or if uh, if it doesn't look like your type of game. So On a Switch, it was only $15. $14.99, that's a pretty good deal. Yeah, it looks like a lot of gameplay for $15. Bucks. Sounds pretty good. Um, check it out, guys, if you like it. Thanks for watching. Uh, we'll be back again soon with some more games that we find that we like to play. We'll be playing some more Skylander games here in the future. And uh, I guess until next time, keep having fun playing games, and we'll see you soon. Bye! Bye.